Um, it's all happened. I, 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 I guess I've done a lot of uh, things, so it's, it's sort of hard to pick what the what the moments were. I mean, uh, certainly, I, you know, I, I retired uh, when I was early 30s, and and then sort of hung about Monaco with my Ferrari and uh, a boat, and uh, I think that was a defining moment because I got pretty sick of that pretty quickly, and also went off the sort of toys toys for the boys, you know, so just sort of thought I had more fun working, and I wasn't really that into all the toys. So that, and then I sort of got more and more, then I gradually got involved in business itself. So I think that was one defining moment. Um, you know, I guess uh, through the years there's been, you know, a lot of different moments when you, in your education and people supported you uh, at school and people who supported you uh, at university and then your early work life who, who really made a difference. So it probably wasn't so much Eureka, Eureka moments for me, it was probably just being given a helping hand by other people at different times. Um, well, I think I think business is about people, and um, I don't know. I seem to get to a, a level where now I get approached by a hell of a lot of people, <laughs> and also uh, I have a lot of contacts from business that I've done in the past. So it's almost self-generating, um, and and so I meet a lot of people, and and I guess I'm a, I feel like a bit like a coach sometimes. I mean, my job is to a bit like a you know a, t a talent scout and choosing the right people to back and choosing their ideas. Um, so. It can be quite a passive process sometimes where I sit back and, and, and people come to me. Um, I, I guess then it's, 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 it's trying to find out if, if, their, if their approach is sensible and if they're sensible. <laughs> um, well, I have to watch myself because I'm a bit of a deal junkie. So my inclination is normally to do anything that sounds vaguely exciting, no matter how ridiculous it is. Uh, so I think what, what so I've gradually learned to be a little bit more careful, um, but but it is the person. It, it's 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 obviously I have to get on with the person. That's the most important thing, um, and then whether I sort of respect them or find something special about that person that I think can make a business work. You know, I, I made some good investments at the end of the, or you know, halfway to, and then the end of the tech wreck, which was obviously a very bleak period as well. I mean, not maybe not as bleak as now, but um, you know, that was some of the best investments I made. So I'm very conscious of that, of that learning experience, and, and whether it can be done again. So I am watching out for, for for very good investments, but on the other hand, I'm not racing out to do things. And the businesses that I've got. Given this environment, I'm really crunching down on costs and, and being careful. I mean, it doesn't mean you don't take risks, because I invest in risky companies, but I'm, I'm just gener pushing a culture of cost awareness. Um, it, it varies enormously. I mean, uh, you know, some companies I have very, very little to do with, um, you know, and it's almost just like a passive investment that anyone would make, uh, you know. Others, others. It's, it's. I'm on the phone twice a day, so it tends, to, it tends to, be, to depend on the relative skills. You know, anything that I can help with. If obviously, if I can't help, I don't waste people's time. Um, and 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 how, you know, how the company's going. You know, when companies are doing well, you know, they, you hear from them every now and then to sort of, you know, have a little bit of a, you know, feel good conversation. But when they're not going so well, then obviously I, they, they get me more and more and more involved. So I tend to spend most of my time on the time on the ones that are struggling. Yeah.